Hey guys, this is a video on conditional probability in case you missed our live session today. So, today our topic is conditional probability. Alright, what does that mean? So, in order to explore some of the ideas of conditional probability, we're going to use a standard deck of cards. Okay? There is a picture of cards in case you don't know what is inside a standard deck of cards. So, let's see... Let's say if you were asked the probability of selecting a heart from a deck of cards, you would get 13 out of 52, right? There are 13 hearts, ace, deuce, three, four, five, all the way up to king, right? Out of a total of 52 cards. Apologize. Um, so, however... There's no condition there, right? There is the condition there. There's no condition in this case, right? It's just, okay, well, what's the probability of selecting a heart? However, if you were asked a probability of getting a heart, given that the card that was selected was a red card, this would be a conditional probability statement. Now, what does that mean? It's on the condition that the card is red, right? So that means... The only cards that it could possibly be is out of this. What happens then? It changes the probability to being out of what? Only the reds. Okay. Or in other words, it would be 13 out of 26. Okay. Now here's the formula. Okay. Probability of H given R. Okay probability of h given r what this means is the probability of h and r right it's a heart and it's red because it has to be both right uh, a heart must be red is 13 out of 52 divided by the probability that it's red which is 26 out of 52 well that's technically what you simplify that to 13 over 26 which is what one half red heart over red so that's one half this is an example of a conditional probability statement. Now, you can use the formula if you want, okay? You can also use, like, logic, okay? Um, we're not going to get into really complex conditional probability statements, but this is just an example of what one would look like, okay? Here's another one. So, if you have marbles in a bag, let's say you have five marbles. Three of them are red and two of them are blue, Okay? When you first pick out of the bag, the chance of getting a blue marble is 2 out of 5. Well, the next time you pick one out, right, the conditions have changed depending on what the first marble is, right? If you take, if you've picked a blue, or if you picked a red on the first trial, now your chance of getting a blue is 2 out of 4. If you picked a blue on the first trial, now your chance of getting a, a blue is 1 out of 4, right? So this is conditional, right? So this is conditional probability. So if uh, I pick, uh, what's the probability of picking a blue? Given I picked a red on the last trial, that would be 2 out of 4. What's the probability I pick a blue? Given I picked a blue on the last trial, now it's 1 out of 4. Another example of conditional probability. Okay? Very basic. Uh, a couple of things. Conditional probability in real life, right? Just going to go through one example because I don't want this uh, to be too long. Attend a live, uh, live session if you want to hear me go on rants about conditional probability in, in real life. Uh, but essentially, weatherman, uh, the weatherman, right? When he starts talking about, oh, yeah, there is a 40% chance of rain. There's a bunch of conditions attached to that, right? There's a condition of a cold front blowing through, possibly rain clouds forming, or another front pushing rain clouds away. These are This is all like conditional probability, okay? It's based on those things. Like we talked about the other day, like, how do we calculate that probability? It's based on, well, so many other days like today with the same symptoms of today end up having rain, okay? So what are the conditions? Whether there are clouds in the sky, you know, 
how many days rained that were like this in the past, cold fronts, whatever. Okay? That's just an example of conditional probability in real life. Here is your homework. Um, hopefully this video helps you in case you didn't know how to do it. Okay? Uh, if you have any questions, please join live session.